There was the Scout Cow playing Kirby's Fireflower Place, Fireplace Place, Jungle. And we're World 6, and you know, now we've had almost, like, and we've got, like, actual, like, not even almost, but, you know, actual, like, puzzles to solve and stuff, and it's... It's getting almost like I wouldn't call it difficult, but you actually need to like pay attention to what you're doing and things like who has the time for that kind of shenanigan, man? There's a witch there. Now she's dead, I think. You're supposed to eat meals every day. If you want to live, it's really useful. Yeah, you gotta find a way to get that guy. You need like beam or something. Who has time to beam a tree? Not me. I'd rather have a cutter because, you know, it's more violent and so more palatable to my teenage-like brain. Let's check out what's over here. A place you can kinda climb. That guy got killed, I'm not sure how, but I sure got a life. That's the ultimate prize in the whoa cutlery machine. We can swim using up underwater, which is pretty cool. Way superior than Mario's, but you can also tap the Jamas. You got all the options. If you want options, we can pretend. In here, yeah, of course there is. There's the button. It's really well hit. It's like it's not even the door. It's, it's just there. It's like, hey, check it out. I enjoy doors. Be I am the imitation door. If you have any requests in terms of luggage carrying capacity, just give me a big old walnut with, you know, the number of teeth you are currently owning written on it. And I'll give it a gander. My plan to just kind of do his thing randomly. Didn't work. A sneeze! Bishu! That was a sneeze. Just look at that. Kirby sneezes, he blows up. The sad story of the sad puffball. Sadness. I guess I'm gonna have telephone pole power up. Yo, by the way, the, the poor. Oh, you see, now they've got telephone power up. You can just go, oh man, I am going up. I don't even care. Parasols do not stop only souls nor para. They also stop parakeets. And whoa, Walt Crisco. So if you ever know a guy that has that exact name, carry a parasol at all time, and you will forever avoid his shoddy lyrics that he keeps writing to tuneless stringing about uh, on his acoustic guitar. Let's play chicken game, and there's two stars because it's two star difficulties just because. I guess I'll check it out, I got eggs. Yo, check it out, I got eggs. Yo, do you want my eggs? Cause I got full of eggs. Where do I get all these eggs? Do I just buy them out of- Wow, that's a lot of bombs to go with all these eggs. <laughs> Man, what egg short? And he's so sad. He really wanted to waste those eggs, but instead he ended up feeding a round guy. I know the feeling, DDD. I know the feeling. Let's go in Nigaloo. In the Orange Ocean! There's Ice Guy. I almost sank. That's pretty funny. Don't freeze me, please. There's a Nigaloo here. Igloos are scary. I don't care about me. This background looks like it's like straight out of Super Mario World. Oh, there's a graphical glitch there. You better fix that because otherwise people are gonna complain loudly about the shoddy quality of your video game. I missed the door somehow because I was flying above the world. Not a care in my sleeves or my pant leg. No, sir. Oh no, but then the water current's gonna come. Oh, it doesn't drown. Yeah, it does destroy them. That's my remember. My remembering, also known as memory, did not fault me. Yo, have a blast of Baja Airface and milk the Connell kid. You don't get mix if the other guy you're drinking doesn't have a power in and of itself. I know it's really unfortunate. Oh, you can go over here and get one up. Oh, dang, homing enemies! Always such a problem. So, here, this thing. Uh, respawning enemy is kind of a problem, also. Well, you guys, just leave me alone. So, what you gotta do here is you light that wick, then you gotta go here to go in this cannon here. See, there's there's reason why. 
So, you gotta contend with constantly respawning enemies, though. That's where the real challenge lies. So, uh... Alright, let's get some magic happening here. Turn around. What? My hot breath wasn't enough. Eh, I don't think that's gonna be fast enough. Like, I'm just kind of floating around. No, see... ah! Can I go back? Because there's the end of the level. I don't wanna end the level. Stupid respawning dudes. So, I don't remember. Is there a door? Freaking... Ah, walnut juice! No! Leave me alone! Leave me alone, known universe! You know what? I'm gonna destroy myself. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna destroy myself. Respawning everything. And there is a door, so... This, this, this way I also got all my health back. I guess. Yeah, that's... No! Turn around! Turn... Help! This is not a friendly area at all. Like, there's... You make no friends atop this mountainside. That is guaranteed. That low-key kind of drifting animation there. Beautiful. Okay, well, I don't get my life back. It's very sad, but whatevs. See here. No, I didn't want to start... I wanted to run, but then somehow the game saw an upward crescent there, and so thought I wanted to fly, thus ruining everything. So I'm just gonna redo this until it works. You know you have to go in that can for something. Maybe it's a plunger, maybe it's dessert, maybe it's the entire African savanna that you get to explore in NES form. That's gonna be pretty rad, right? It has to be. There's, uh, there's, I'm running. Ah, uh, uh, go, go! You stop running, you fiendish fool! I won, but I'm still complaining! Ah, Starmouth Kirby! Explorer of the ocean depths! Ooh, Jaywalker! An all around goof troop! An honorary member! He's the one that has no teeth at all, because the verb he exists is that is, you know, it's swallowing, not chewing. Well, I got perfect on that, right? I don't, I don't feel like timing buttons, I don't know. Gonna go in Astral Space Town, where I get nothing, and I says hello. I got beam now, though. So I'm just gonna take it slow and just do that to all my enemies. Isn't there something, like, here? Yeah, and if I remember right... You need... Uh, a special, specific little friend to access there. Wow! <laughs> that was... That was kind of... This guy! Yeah! Look at that, I'm a UFO. You need a UFO to break that block. Because obviously... Ugh! Turn around and destroy! Or destroy with this? Yeah, someone pointed out in video one, Kirby actually gets out a little gun to fire his thing. I think that's hilarious and maybe not appropriate. Oh, I'm a UFO. I don't judge. I just fly around. Look at my beautiful ballet moves. Well, that's not. We don't want to give people heartaches when they realize they can't do the same. Now I'm somewhere in space. You know, these are space clouds. Wow, just destroy everyone. No survivor here. Survivors. Wow, they can shoot missiles too? I'm gonna go enter the moon. I can't enter the moon. I keep thinking can enter the moon. You can in the original Kirby. Maybe that's why I keep thinking you can. Like, those are solid, right? These are solid! I'm beaming backward while moving. It's very, very confusing. Did I destroy the moon, by the way? Like, why is there a moon left? Oh, hey, buddies. How are you guys doing? Having a good time in your in your basement there? Hope you don't mind if I one-shot you, right? Like, I mean, it's just my Star Crusher gun laser gun. Nothing personal or anything. Yo, check it out. The water spots. There's windows so you can see the beautiful gray sky. Oh, what marvelous weather we have. I'm just floating above. <laughs> because you know, the UFO works on the water, works over the water. 
gonna fight a bunch of brigands. Uh, bandits sometimes are known as. Actually, I don't know how these guys are known collectively. I, I just destroy them. I don't judge. I just kill. <laughs> Dang it. I want my UFO back. I better not have lost my UFO because of you. It's a very rare power. I hate you forever. I will digest you with all my rage. As you can see by the extremely long hill bar bottom, there's a lot of minions to slay in this particular round of Yo, check out Meta Knight's duders, pretty swell. They got hammers and sickles and Whoa, ice physics? I didn't realize there were ice physics in this game because you spend so little time actually like walking on the ground. It's actually kind of funny <laughs> when you kind of think about it. And then another Kirby's like, yo, check it out. I got this size, this is 5,000. What do you got? An appetite. Wow, good job. Let's go fight Meta Knight. Hey, Meta Knight, how's it going? Get it? No, I don't, but that's okay. I got the Swordy. And dude's like the moon, like, you know, Mr. 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 Shine. Or is it Mr. Bright? I forget which is who. He's looking out, out there. So, in the NES version of this fight, uh, you're kind of at a disadvantage because Kirby knows to do one thing, and that swishes Sora around. When you do, they do, did this fight again in the Super Nintendo game, Kirby Superstar, because you got like a million fighting move style command moves you can do, uh, the fight is a lot more fair, but instead they kind of balance it out by making Meta Knight even more super. Because now it's just basically, yo, I got a sword. And you can see you got these uppercut moves. I guess, uh, I guess you can't just like sit there and do your business in this version of the fight. You need to actually like try and stuff. Wow, good job. You did the down A. I bet you're real proud of yourself. What? You can block? I can't block. That's, I don't know, man. That's... I guess it's to encourage you to know, learn how to backstab people. Nintendo always has it out there to make sure that children learn useful skills such as typing and consuming mushrooms they found inside boxes. Oh man, wow, well this guy is actually legit kinda tough, but also I'm legit not kinda trying as much as I feel like I could due to the fact that the game never really seems to expect you to try all that much. Let's be honest. What? I hit you once there and you lost no health at all. Like the screen went all bajwees. Like that means you got hurt. There you, you lost multiple bars. So I don't know. Maybe he's got like his armor. So like the first time he gets hurt, it doesn't count. Is, is, is that how damage resistant works in Kirby's universe? I mean, if that's the case, like that's fine. I just want to know the rules set ahead of time. You no? Know? Is that really that criminal, buddy? Wow. Midair clash advantage Kirby. More like backstab, and yet somehow I cut your mouth in pieces. I cut you in the back so hard that you could fell it in your front and cleaved your armor a twine. How you feel about that, you little wizard type Kirby? Well, I can cast mirror image in order to make a dance. Rainbow Resort is the seventh world and the last real world of the game. Kirby here cheated by apparently having two powers at once. Bad Kirby. Naughty. You can't do those kind of things.